Hi, today I'm going to talk to you about Ember WM, a window manager I've been working on for the past few weeks. So here we are on the main workspace of the window manager. So let's uh, go ahead and uh, launch a web browser. Go to the project web page. Okay. So the first thing you want to do is uh, launch a terminal and uh, let's go ahead and do as the documentation says. So you need uh, to install Rust and Cargo to use it. So because it is co it is coding in Rust and the configuration is in Rust. So the first thing you want to do is copy this, clone the, the this repository. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. And then all you have to do is edit the main.rs file and read. So what you do here is configure your your uh, window manager. So the first key here is uh, what uh, is the main key used to um, uh, for the window manager actions. So you have the choice between mod four or mod one at the at the moment. The second uh, part is our borders. So you can you can define uh, the border for your uh, your display. So here I have defined a top border of 20 pixels uh, because I'm using X mode, X mode bar. This uh, needs uh, 20 pixels. So it is a gap uh, between the border of the of the screen basically. You can define uh, the the size of your border. So here I have a a border of one pixel the color when it is focused so here it is purple and what it is it is not focused so it is black you can define the gaps between your windows if you want here i have a gap of 10 pixels and then you define the keys to push to switch to your workspace which is uh, is the workspace name so here I have uh, several workspaces. For example, let's go to the U. We are on workspace A. So if I push super A, I will keep on being on the first workspace. Let's go on the third workspace, uh, super I. Okay, so here we are. Then you can uh, define custom actions. So for example, here when you, you press uh, super R, it will launch uh, Rofi. So this is how it is done. Another one is uh, how to quit uh, the the window manager with a uh, super Q. Then you can define uh, the keys for uh, the window manager actions. For uh, for example, to switch between windows, you press super space. So here we can switch between windows. Uh, let's spawn a new window. To close a window, you can uh, do super W. And to switch uh, layout, you you can press super F. So let's here we are on BSP uh, layout, the default one. But we can go to full screen layout, which will f give the windows which has focus the the, the full screen. Or we can go to horizontal and let's go back to vertical uh, BSP, which is the default. Here you define the float classes, uh, classes of windows that won't be uh, touched by uh, the uh, like a GIMP or uh, or some window that you don't want uh, the the window manager to to change uh, the size. And you can define auto float types, which are kind of windows that you don't want the window manager to to modify. So, for example, notifications you don't want the the notifications to be tiled. So, 
this is uh, the kind of things you can define here and also uh, last but not least the event callbacks so for now i have just uh, defined one callback uh, which uh, which is uh, when you change a workspace it, this function will be called so for example i use here this callback to change the background by uh, selecting a picture and using nitro nitrogen to to display uh, this picture so for example here let's go to workspace i and you can see the picture has changed and this is how uh, that is done so once you've configured your uh, your uh, your main dot uh, you can uh, build it and this will uh, be the binary binary which will be used to run uh, your uh, your window manager so you just have to put that in your x, x uh, init uh, configuration file and uh, this will run the window manager uh, hope you liked it and uh, thank you for watching